Although you know everybody knows that there are risks involved, it's still a, a terrible shock and it's why I think everybody is concerned to do everything possible to make sure the highest safety standards are met and that's what uh, the unions, the management and everybody I talked to this morning were all saying that's so important and why we need a full investigation into what has happened. Do you think it calls into question the levels of safety here at Kellingley? Well, I think we have to wait for the results of the investigation. I mean, clearly there were uh, specific reasons that came out from the previous investigations, but we need to have the full answers to that and look at, you know, whether there are uh, wider questions that need to be raised. But at the moment, the experts are doing that. Uh, you know, that work is underway, uh, and so we'll listen to what they have to say. As a constituency MP in a mining area, you know very well how close these communities are. This will have a really strong impact on them, won't it? Well, it does. It has ripples out for everybody because obviously there are people who work at Kellingley at the moment and all of their families across the area, but also in an area like this, then actually a lot of families have somebody in the family who used to work in the pits who kind of identify with what's happening and the way everybody's feeling. And so I think everybody across the community will feel it, but they'll also all rally round. You've been in there this morning. What were you hearing from the from the miners in there, from the mine workers? Well, everybody's still in a state of shock, really. It's, uh, I think, and deeply saddened, of course. You know, to, to to lose a colleague, to lose a workmate in these circumstances is is just deeply distressing for everyone there. Uh, everyone's thinking about the family as well as thinking about what needs to be done in terms of the safety issues. Um, and you know, they're going to take some time to be, to be thinking about that and paying their respects as well. Following this and obviously the four deaths in Wales a couple of weeks ago, do you think there's a, a need now for a, an overall review of, of safety in the mines? Well, we need to obviously get the results from this investigation and find out what's happened. But I think it is right that all of these safety issues do need to be looked at. But I know that I mean, the management and the unions here have talked to me this morning about their commitment to the highest possible safety levels. Um, and so, of course, people need to know whether there are issues that link these incidents because you know, we want to keep people safe um, when they're doing a, an important job.